You know what time it is. It's time for a Sam's Club haul. I don't have as much today, but that's okay. I'm going to be able to talk a little bit more about each item because I'll have more time to. So let's just get started. So up here in the front, I have some premium bacon from a brand called DAC. Is that how you say it? I'm not sure. I've never bought this brand before. I usually get the Oscar Mayer. But this is a little bit cheaper at Sam's Club, so I decided to give this brand a try. And this comes with three packs of bacon. So, and these are like the regular size that you would get at the grocery store. But there's three in here, so we'll give those a try in the morning. Over here I have some of the Frigo cheese heads. This is a string cheese, and there are, let's see, how many are there? Okay, here it is down here. 48 one-ounce pieces of the um, string cheese. It's 100% natural string cheese and these are really good for the kids. They really like those. So over here I got some Jimmy Dean premium pork sausage and it says regular and this is a 32 ounce like roll so I guess you like chop off the end and then you like make little little patties out of it. Um, I haven't gotten this before from Sam's Club so I'm excited to try this out. Here I have some Daily Chef Sharp Cheddar Cheese, and this is a 32 ounce block. Um, they have mild cheese, which is cheaper, but um, I, I like to get the Sharp Cheddar Cheese because for a lot of recipes, it, it will call for the Sharp Cheddar Cheese, so I just went ahead and got that. I like to shred this at home and put it on salad or just with meals like tacos. We make a lot of tacos around here, so... Up front, I have some of the Eggland's Best, and this is 18 large eggs. And I was excited to see these. I don't think I've noticed this brand at Sam's Club before. I usually buy some eggs from Publix, and I like to kind of go with a, not really organic, but like a more all-natural type egg. And I hadn't noticed that Sam's had anything like that until tonight. So I was excited to get these, and these eggs are so pretty. Let me show you these eggs. I guess because it's October Breast Cancer Awareness Month. So these eggs have the um, pink ribbon and the EB for Eglin's Best. Aren't they really pretty? Like really pretty eggs. So those are super cute. Over here I have a bag of the Taylor Farms Iceberg and Romaine Blend. I usually get the Garden Blend. But I decided to get um, this kind, and it's preservative free, and this is a 40 ounce or two and a half pound bag. And I know I've said before that I was not going to buy salad because I let it go bad, but for the price, like, it's worth it to get it, even if some goes to waste, because it's still cheaper than the bags of salad at Publix, even, and you get a whole lot more. So, it, you know, I just went ahead and got it, and I am going to try to eat more salad I did really good where I ate a salad every day for lunch, and I'm going to try to really push myself to do that again because I did lose weight when I was doing that. So I'm going to I'm gonna strive, guys. I'm going to strive for it. Okay, over here I have some of the Gala Apples. I always get apples because this is like a favorite snack for my kids, and of course they're healthy, and there are actually 12 apples in this bag says it's a five pound bag and I get the gala apples because they are the cheapest apples that Sam's Club has there are some different kinds but they do cost a lot more so I just grab whichever's cheapest I mean apples are apples right so I just grab whatever's cheaper and they like them so over here is a new item that I saw tonight at Sam's Club it's the Pirate's Booty um, aged white cheddar and when I was in the store, I thought this was popcorn. But when I got home and I opened it up, I realized that it's kind of like a cheese doodle type. Let me pull one out so you can see. So this is what they look like. And these are really good. They taste like the Cheeto Puffs. And these, this is a 16-ounce uh, size. And I love what it says in the front. It's kind of funny. They see, there be good, great for parties. And it says, yes, baked rice and corn puffs, all natural, gluten, and trans fat free. And this is a 16-ounce bag. So I'm hoping the kids will like these. Um, I've gotten the mac and cheese puffs from Sam's before, and they didn't care for them too much. So I'm hoping that they'll like these a lot better. So back here I have my on-the-border tortilla chips. 
if you guys follow me in these videos, you know how much we like these. But for some new folks that might be tuning in for the first time watching my hauls, I'll let you guys know how much we love these tortilla chips. I like to make guacamole and dip these with salsa. These are really good. They're the cafe style. This is a 24 ounce bag and they are with sea salt, gluten free, low sodium and zero grams of trans fat. And you can also warm these up and this is a huge bag and I like the value of it because you get so many for a really good price. Okay, back here I have some of the Homemaker Premium 100% Pure Premium Squeezed Original Orange Juice. And this comes in a two pack and it has the twist cap lids here. And let's see, each container is 59 fluid ounces or 1.8 quarts. And so this comes in a two pack and we like to have this with breakfast. And tomorrow's Saturday so hubby will be cooking breakfast for everybody. All right, let's see. Down here, I have a let's see one, two, three, four pack of the Capri Suns, and there are ten in each box, and the flavors are fruit punch, strawberry kiwi, wild cherry, and the Pacific Cooler. And I like that these are um, they've made these a lot healthier than they used to be. Let's see if I can see where it says. Oh, right here. Okay. It says 25% less sugar, no artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives, which is really, really cool. And, like, these things are really affordable, these Capri Suns, so I was glad about that. Let's see, over here, I have my paper towels. This is, let me, okay, I kind of got it crooked, so hopefully you guys can see this. This is the Members Mark brand, which is a Sam's Club brand. And it says 15 mega rolls, which equals 30 regular rolls. And they are the select and tear. And it says strong, thick, and absorbent. I love these paper towels. These, to me, are as good as, like, a name brand. <laughs> oh, my gosh, they're heavy. A name brand paper towel. They're really thick. And I love that you can select your size. And it says 154 two-ply sheets per roll. And there are 15 rolls in here. And I ran out of these, so I picked some up tonight, but I haven't bought them in a long time, so I know that these will last me a while. And over here, I have my toilet paper. This is also Member Smart brand. And let's see. Down here, oh, they marked out 36, and this is now nine more. So 45 large rolls equals 104 regular rolls, and it says 192 ply sheets per roll. So what it is is it comes in, um, let's see, nine packs there's one two three you can't even see what i'm doing hang on one two three four five of those and i actually have two of these left but i was thinking okay i'll go ahead and pick up some since i am low on them but i love this toilet paper it's it, again it's as good as a name brand toilet paper and it's a lot cheaper so this is where i get my toilet papers from sam's club so, let's see, over here I have some cereal. I think this was new at Sam's Club. I haven't seen it before. But it's the Chex Party Mix Variety Pack. So they have the Corn Chex, the Wheat Chex, and the Rice Chex. All three of them are in here, so let me show you. The size of the bags and everything. Okay, so this is the Wheat Chex. And that's a pretty good size bag right there. So that's the Wheat. I think this is the Rice. And then we have the corn. So this is a nice healthy cereal and they smell really good. Like I can smell it through the bag. It makes me want a bowl, although it's like 10 o'clock at night. Okay, so over here, oh, I love this stuff. Okay, the International Delight Pumpkin Pie Spice. I have already gone through a two pack of these and I ran out and I had to get French vanilla. And I was like, oh man, I can't wait till I can get to Sam's to get some more of this creamer because I love it. If you guys haven't tried it, I recommend you giving it a try. And I love this time of year when this is available and the fact that Sam's Club had it in a two-pack. Like, super excited. Okay, so the last thing I'm going to show you guys is my pumpkin. They have pumpkins at Sam's Club. And they're gigantic and they're really, really nice. Isn't this a nice pumpkin? Like, I don't know if you can tell, like, how big it is. Like, it's gigantic. It's a huge pumpkin. And I loved that it had this nice little curvy stem on the top. I like pumpkins that still have the stems on it because it just looks very natural. 
So this is our pumpkin. I'm gonna put this in the front of the house. And I don't think that I wanna cut into it. I think the kids want to, but I kinda of wanna just maybe draw a face on it. I don't know, what do you guys think? What do you normally do with your pumpkins? I know it's like more traditional to cut a face, but it doesn't seem like they last as long when you do that. And it is the beginning of October. So I'm not sure if it would still be any good by Halloween. But I think I might just draw a nice little face on it. And I'm sure the kids will be happy with that if I let them do a little doodling on it also. So I think that's it for my Sam's Club haul. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions about anything, just leave some comments below and make sure to give it a thumbs up. And I appreciate you guys asking me when my next Sam's Club haul video was because that lets me know that you guys enjoy it. Oh, you know what? Brown sugar. I forgot the brown sugar. Yes, brown sugar. Okay, sorry. Okay, so I have the Daily Chef um, Old Fashioned Flavor Light Brown Sugar. And this is a seven pound bag. I haven't bought this in a while because I haven't needed to. We were low on it. Um, Joel uses this for his oatmeal and he only uses like a few teaspoons of it. So it lasts him forever, but he was low on it. So I went ahead and picked some of that up. So again, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'm sure with the next haul, there will be a lot more, but uh, the one before this, I got so much stuff that I just didn't need to get as much. Like you to see that I didn't really buy any meat this time, but I still have a lot left over. So thanks for joining me and I will talk to you all soon. Bye.